Hello everyone, welcome to Record Review. My name is Chad. Today we are going to be talking about Queens of the Stone Ages, Songs for the Deaf. This is an album that I've heard the two big hit songs, No One Knows and Go With The Flow. I've heard them a lot before, but I never really had listened to the whole album. I wanted to listen to the whole album and really get an experience of it, pick out some more songs that are not hits but equally as good songs for the deaf was released in 2002 by interscope records it is dubbed a concept album so the listener is supposed to be in a car driving from la to joshua tree changing radio stations throughout the whole lead vocals is josh ami guitar is josh ami as well bass is nick oliveri drums is dave grohl of the foo fighters and nirvana and there's a lot of appearances from mark lanigan in there he's a uh, singer that you hear in mad season and i think he's got his own band now this record topped out at 17 on the billboard charts songs that i think that you should check out say i ain't worth a dollar but i feel like a millionaire it's the first song on the album amazing way to open amazing song to open up the album a very huge difference from no one knows and go with the flow it's very fast very hard uh, lots of screaming very different from what i thought what I perceive the Queens of the Stone Age as. Song for the Dead, The Sky Has Fallen, Do It Again, God Is In The Radio, A Song for the Deaf, and Mosquito Song. I know that this is a really, really, really good album, and I'm really glad that I decided to listen through instead of just listening to No One Knows and Go With The Flow. Lots of good songs. Highly suggest anybody listen to it. It's got a lot of subtle differences in there. It's very changing. It's not just one blaring genre of music it kind of dips into psychedelic and orchestral music there at the end with the mosquito song anyway how check out queens of the stone age anyways check out queens of the stone ages song for the deaf thank you